Om Shanti. This is the Sakar Murli of the 8th of February 2024. Essence, sweet children, always remember that you are Brahmins, the top knots. You are becoming elevated, therefore remain cheerful. Learn to talk to yourself and you will experience limitless happiness. Question. Who can take refuge with the Father? To whom does the Father give refuge? Answer. Only those who are complete destroyers of attachment and whose intellect's yoga is broken away from everywhere else can take refuge with the Father. Your intellect should have no attachment to friends or relatives. It should remain in your intellect. Mine is only one Baba and none other. Only such children can do service. Only to such children does the Father give refuge. Om Shanti That one is the spiritual father, teacher and guru. You children have now understood this very clearly. The world does not know this. Although sannyasis say of themselves, Shivo hum, I am Shiva, they do not say that they are the father, teacher and guru. They simply say of themselves, Shivo hum, I am Shiva, Tatwam, the same applies to you. If God were omnipresent, then everyone would become the father, teacher and guru. However, no one considers himself to be this. It is absolutely wrong for human beings to call themselves God, the supreme soul. Whatever the father explains to the children, it has to be imbibed by your intellects. There are so many subjects in other studies. It is not that all the subjects remain in the intellects of the students. Here, whatever the father teaches, it enters the children's intellect in a second. You relate the knowledge of the creator and the beginning, the middle and the end of creation. You become knowers of the three aspects of time and spinners of the discus of self-realization. In physical studies, all the subjects are completely different. You prove and explain to everyone that only the one father is the bestower of salvation for all. All souls remember the supreme soul They say, O God the Father, therefore you must surely receive the inheritance from the Father. People experience sorrow when they lose that inheritance. This is a play about happiness and sorrow. At this time, all are impure and unhappy. You definitely experience happiness by becoming pure. It is the Father who establishes the world of happiness. You children have to keep it in your intellects that it is the Father who is explaining to you. Only the one Father is knowledgeful. The Father gives the knowledge of the beginning, the middle and the end of the world. All other religions that have been established come at their own time. These things are not in anyone else's intellect. The Father has kept this study very easy for you children. He simply explains to you in detail. Remember me, your Father, 
and you will become Sato Pradhan from Tamo Pradhan. Yoga is praised a great deal. The ancient yoga of Bharat has been remembered, but no one knows what benefits were received by performing yoga. This same yoga which incorporeal God teaches is that which is mentioned in the Gita. All other yogas are taught by human beings. There is no question of yoga for the deities. It is human beings who teach Hatha yoga, etc. Deities neither study that nor teach others it. There is no question of yoga in the divine world. By performing yoga, everyone becomes pure. They would surely become that here. The father comes at the confluence age to make the world new. You are now being transferred from the old world to the new world. It is a wonder to explain this to someone. We Brahmins are the top knots. The Brahmins, top knots, are between the Iron Age and the Golden Age. This is called the Confluence Age, in which you become elevated. If it remains in the intellects of you children that you are becoming the most elevated beings, you remain constantly cheerful. The more service you do, the more cheerful you remain. You have to earn an income and inspire others to earn one. The more service you do at the exhibitions, the more happiness those who listen to you will receive. There will be benefit for you and for others too. Even at small centres, there should be five to six main pictures. It is easy to explain them. You should do service and more service the whole day. You should not have any attachment to your friends or relatives. Everything that you see with your eyes is going to be destroyed. But whatever you see in divine visions is being established. Continue to talk to yourself in this way and you will become strong. You should experience the happiness of having met the unlimited father. Someone born to a king has pure pride. You children are becoming the masters of heaven. You are all making effort for yourselves. The father simply says, By sitting on the pyre of lust, you have become ugly. Now sit on the pyre of knowledge and you will become beautiful. These thoughts should continue to spin in your intellects. Even when you are sitting in your office, you should continue to have remembrance. It is not that you don't have time. Whatever time you have, earn a spiritual income. It is such a great income. You receive both health and wealth simultaneously. There is a story of Arjuna and a Bill, native. While living at home with your family, you can go ahead faster in knowledge and yoga than the ones who live here. Everything depends on remembrance. If all of you were to sit here, how would service be done? Become refreshed and then engage yourself in doing service. You should have thoughts of service. Baba cannot go to the exhibitions because both Bap and Dada are together. Baba's soul and this one's soul are together. This is a wonderful couple. No one except you children can know this couple. 
Baba considers himself to be part of a couple and he also says, I am the only long lost and now found son of Baba. He experiences great happiness on seeing this picture of Lakshmi and Narayan. This is my next birth. I will definitely sit on the throne. You too are studying Raj Yoga. The aim and objective is in front of you. This one has the happiness of being the long lost and now found son of Baba. Nevertheless, he is not able to maintain constant happiness. His thoughts wander in different directions. It is not a law of the drama that remembrance remains constant and that no other thoughts come. Storms of Maya do not allow you to have remembrance. I know that it is very easy for me because Baba has entered me. I am the number one long lost and now found child of Baba. I will become the first number prince. Nevertheless, I forget to have remembrance. Many types of thoughts come. This is Maya. It is only when this Baba has had this experience that he can explain to you children. These thoughts will stop when you reach your karmatit stage. This body will not remain when the soul becomes complete. Shiv Baba is constantly pure. It is in his part to come into the impure world and enter an impure body in order to make it pure. He is also bound by the drama. When you become pure, you will need new bodies. Shiv Baba does not have his own body. It is this soul, Brahma Baba, in this body who has importance. What does that one have? He speaks a merly and departs. He is free. Sometimes he comes here and sometimes he goes somewhere else. You children also feel that it is Shiv Baba who speaks the Merleys. You children understand that you are present on this godly service in order to help the father. The father says, I have come here after leaving my sweet home. The supreme region means the incorporeal world which is in the land beyond. However, the whole play continues on this earth. You understand that this is a wonderful play. However, there is just the one world. Those people try to go to the moon. That is the power of science. When we gain victory over science with the power of silence, Science too will then give happiness. Here science gives happiness as well as sorrow. There, there is nothing but happiness. There is no trace of sorrow. These things should remain in your intellects the whole day. Baba has so many thoughts. Those in bondage are beaten so much for poison. Some, however, become trapped due to attachment. Those whose intellects have faith will quickly say, We want to drink nectar. For this, you need to become destroyers of attachment. Your hearts should be removed from the old world. Only such serviceable ones can climb onto the heart throne. They can be given asylum. A Kumari takes refuge with her husband, but she is not kept without poison. 
for that she has to take refuge with the Father. However, you need to become complete destroyers of attachment. We have met the husband of all husbands and so we now become engaged to him with our intellect's yoga. Mine is only one and none other. Just as a Kumari forges love with her husband, so this is love of souls for the Supreme Soul. You receive sorrow from that one, whereas you receive happiness from this one. This is the confluence age. No one knows about it. You should have so much happiness. We have met the boatman, the gardener, who takes us to the garden of flowers. At this time all human beings have become like thorns. The biggest thorn is lust. At first you were viceless flowers. Then your degrees gradually decreased and you have now become big thorns. Baba is also called Babulnath, Lord of Thorns. You know that the original name is Shiva. He is called Babulnath because he changes thorns into flowers. Many names are given to him on the path of devotion. In fact, there is only the one name, Shiva. Whether you say the sacrificial fire of the knowledge of Rudra or the sacrificial fire of the knowledge of Shiva, it is the same thing. The flames of destruction were ignited from the sacrificial fire of the knowledge of Rudra. Then the land of Sri Krishna, that is, the original eternal deity religion, was established. Through this sacrificial fire, you become deities from human beings. They create such wonderful pictures. They show Brahma emerging from the navel of Vishnu. You know all of these things. You know that it is Brahma and Saraswati who become Lakshmi and Narayan. You have this faith. Lakshmi and Narayan become Brahma and Saraswati after taking 84 births. People are amazed when they hear these things. They must experience happiness too, but Maya is no less. Lust is the greatest enemy. Maya traps you in someone's name or form and makes you fall. She does not allow you to remember the father. That happiness is then reduced. You should not become happy that you have explained to many others. You should first see to what extent you remember Baba. Do I remember Baba before going to sleep at night or do I forget? Some children are very firm in their discipline. You children are very lucky. There is a huge burden on this father's head. However, the chariot receives a concession. He has knowledge and yoga. Without these, how could he attain the status of Lakshmi and Narayan? Baba has the happiness of being the only child of the father and having many children. He has this intoxication, but Maya creates obstacles too. You children too must be experiencing obstacles from Maya. The Karmatit stage will come as you go further. This Bap and Dada are together. He says, Sweetest children, the father is the ocean of love. This one's soul is together with that one. 
this one also has love. He understands that whatever act others see him do, they will do the same. You have to remain very sweet. You children need to be very sensible. Just look how sensible this Lakshmi and Narayan are. They receive the kingdom of the world by being sensible. Many subjects are created through exhibitions. Barrett is so large and so you have to do that much service. Secondly, you have to stay in remembrance and have your sins absolved. The greatest concern is how we can become Sato Pradhan from Tamo Pradhan. There is effort in this. There are many chances for doing service. You can do service with the badge on trains. This is Baba and this is the inheritance. Barrett definitely became heaven 5,000 years ago. It was the kingdom of Lakshmi and Narayan. Their kingdom definitely has to come again. We are becoming the masters of the pure world by having remembrance of Baba. A lot of service can be done on trains. You should do service in one carriage and then go on to the next one. Those who do such service climb onto the heart throne. Tell them, we want to tell you some good news. You were worthy of worship deities and while taking 84 births, you became worshippers. Now become worthy of worship again. The picture of the ladder is very good. With that, you can prove the stages of Sato, Rajo and Tamo. In schools at the end, near their examination, students have an interest in galloping ahead. Here too it is explained that those who have wasted time should gallop and become engaged in doing service. There is a lot of margin for doing service. Many serviceable daughters whom Baba can send somewhere should emerge. Very good service can take place in the temples. Those of the deity religion will understand instantly. You can also explain at the places where people go to bathe in the Ganges. Their hearts will definitely accept this. Acha. To the sweetest beloved, long lost and now found children, love, remembrance and good morning from the mother, the father, Bat Dada. The spiritual father says Namaste to the spiritual children and the spiritual children say Namaste to the spiritual father. Essence for Dana 1. In order to remain constantly cheerful, do spiritual service. Earn a true income and inspire others to earn one. Bring benefit to yourself as well as others. Do service with your badge on trains. 2. Remove your heart from this old world. Become a destroyer of attachment. Have true love for the one Father. Blessing. May you become a hero actor by knowing the importance of the confluence age and thereby paying special attention at every moment. While performing every act, constantly have this blessing in your awareness. I am a hero actor. Every act of yours will then be special and so every second, every moment 
and every thought will be elevated. You cannot say that only five minutes were ordinary. Even five minutes of the confluence age are very important. Five minutes here are greater than five years there. Therefore, pay attention to the time. In order to receive your fortune of the kingdom for all time, also pay attention all the time. Slogan For those who have the power of determination in their thoughts, every task is possible. Om Shanti